You're watching continuing coverage of a severe weather alert. Even though Rhode Island is the smallest state, snowfall totals can vary depending on where you live. And as is often the case, northwestern Rhode Island got the brunt of the snow yet again. Our severe weather team coverage continues from Gloucester now with Eyewitness News reporter Walt Buto. Up here in Foster and Gloucester, 8 to 10 inches of snow was no problem. What do you got? 8 inches. Under a foot is just a flurry in this well-equipped Gloucester neighborhood. You got a plow and you're using a snowblower. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I just got it running yesterday, so... Up here, they save the heavy equipment for the big ones. To the Listen window. to John Reese's story from 1978. Came right up to the top of that because it was like, you know, wind. And the we had snow a went up to the top of the windows? Top of the windows, like a big, like it was, a, you know, like a big slide. One village away, this Chapachet business owner was plowing his parking lot. Another resident almost smiling at the thought that a storm like this would get in the way for very long. Yeah, we're used to uh, getting buried up to our butts in uh, snow. Um, it is the, uh, the home base of no school Foster Gloucester. <laughs> <laughs> so the major roads, Route 6 and 44, were clear by noon. And once porches and driveways were snow free, even grown ups could be convinced to play. You got to get the legs going too, though. Did you get the legs going, too? Yeah. Okay. For a true snow angel. <laughs> I'm sure this is what my grandchildren are doing right now. Because they love the snow. So they tell us they're ready for the next storm, even if it's this weekend. In the mobile newsroom in Gloucester, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.